Hello everybody, it's September and I'm checking in from the PTS server and today I'm going to look at the new loot drops. As you can see, I've got a couple dead corpses here and uh, we're getting straight up copper for these kills. And you'll notice um, this is a second corpse, but there is no coin purse whatsoever on this corpse. That one's got the regular. Uh, that one's also got a regular. Oops, I didn't uh, show that. But uh, let me let me show you what I'm talking about here. Um, so I've killed I've killed a fair amount of these guys already, and I've only gotten four coin purses and two loot crates. And uh, I'll collect a bunch of them, but I want to show you the uh, the uh, drop. What's going on with these drops here? <laughs> so that one had a, a coin purse and about a silver, half a silver and a coin purse, and uh, about a silver. So you see, the coin purses aren't 100% drops like they uh, used to be on live. And the uh, these little crate thingies, um, well, they just keep coming, don't they? Whoops, wrong button. Ah, once again, so again, no coin purse, about half a silver, and some uh, obsidian mats. Three quarters of a silver coin purse, obsidian mats. Um, so. Anyway, these crates, I was going over these crates. Um, it doesn't really tell you uh, what's inside of these. And I thought there was a, uh, one was a, um, like a Archeum pouch type thing where you just get mats and stuff. And the other one was straight up coins. I think the coin purse is straight up coins. Let's check that out. Yeah, so 25 silver, 32 silver. 26 silver, 29 silver, 30 silver, 30 silver, and 22 silver. And stat-wise, um, my skills are uh, larceny. I was maxed. Um, go ahead and crank that up because now the skills go up to level 230. Or two, 200, I'm sorry, 230,000 is the new skill cap so I've got a ways to go and let's take a look at these uh, crates yep so that's the other stuff so the crates are the other stuff they seem to drop a lot less than the coin purses but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and collect a, a let's say 200 coin purses real quick and we'll compare what we get hey welcome back um, I take a little break there, pause the video. What I wanted to do was collect some coin purses real quick. Um, I think I said 200, <laughs> um, but uh, due to the time restraints on the openness of the server um, and the new drop rates, which are um, about one in three, maybe? About one in three, I would say, for the coin purses. Um, so what I ended up with, um, I spent a little over 30 minutes um, farming these uh, mobs here in Sun Gold as a revenant. My favorite mobs to farm. What I also forgot was they changed a lot of the skills. So um, some of my normal methods of farming um, weren't quite as productive as they could have been. I'm not going to go into skill changes in this video. Let's talk about the loot. Um, I did, did also wind up in a couple PvP skirmishes. Um, there's a lot of people out here playing. Uh, did die, so I didn't lose much time, but um, in about 30 minutes, I, uh, I would say I killed about 300 mobs and uh, got uh, 75 coin purses and 12 of the crates. Um, the, the coin droppage on the mobs was anywhere from like uh, 40 to 90 copper each and those are level 53 kind of common mobs so um you know 300 mobs let's just say i got about 60 copper on average um 
you know, that's about a little less than two gold uh, straight from the mob killing. Didn't cost me any labor to do that, so there's that. Um, and then you got your coin purses, um, which, you know, we showed a little earlier in the video. There's just straight up coins. Um, and it's, it's uh, silver packages on these prince purses. Um, and I'm going to go try to do some floor one library before the server shuts down and I'll uh, add that to the video after I pop these open. Um, so what we're seeing here is silver range anywhere from about 24 silver to a little over 30 silver. Yeah, 31 silver, 24 silver. So that, I mean, that's about what you're going to expect. So if you're straight up silver, straight up silver, I got about two gold for the uh, mobs. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm going to get about another 24 gold for these uh, purses. That's, I'm, is that 24? Uh, let's say 25 silver per at 100 would be, uh, yeah, about 24 gold. So there's 26 gold um, and uh, about uh, the straight up value in labor would have been about... Um, uh, let's see, I opened, I don't know, 10 or 12 earlier. So about 800 labor. Um, of course, it's discounted for me. Um, so it cost me 700 labor. Let's just say 700 labor to open 100 purses. Um, and I'm going to end up with about 27 gold, and that took about 30 minutes. Uh, it's not a super fast way to earn gold. Um, but uh, these, these purses can be stockpiled, and you can... Um, just kind of log in and, and go through them as you as you see fit. Um, so let's go ahead and get these these last bits open. You'll see while I was also at, oh I, I needed to mention this is if you look up here, um, you'll see that I actually had five loot buffs on, or no four loot buffs. Uh, the greedy dwarven, the greedy go goblin gummies, the lucky quicksilver, and the elixir. The Elixir of Greed? That's wrong. That's the uh, Greedy Grimoire book, but it's saying Elixir of Greed. Hmm. Never noticed that. Okay, so there's all those purses. And then I did get 12 of the Prince's Crate, um, a total of 14 out of 100. Um, so, you know, that's it's not a super high rate. Um, it took 30 minutes to... I, I opened two earlier, so let's just say I got 15 in 30 minutes. Um, and this is where you're going to get your Archeum and your Regrade Razors and things like that. The Rumbling Trees. Mysterious Garden Powder. Wow, I got two of those. It's good. There's three, four, four of the Mysterious Garden Powders. And then you'll notice that some of these are dropping three trees, three braziers. That's kind of good. All right. So there you have the loot drops. The other things that I did get was a couple of these Lost Garden Faded Weapons. And if you remember, if you're a live stream watcher, what they did do is they, they changed it to where when you open these, you won't get the basic one anymore. So your minimum grade is always the grand, which is the ones that you can disenchant for Archeum, uh, Crystal Shards, Dust. Um, that should be the same with these uh, divine gardens. Yeah, so I didn't get a didn't get a, a basic. They all been grand so far, uh, and no one try on XL games. Likely what they did is they lowered the higher rates by they lowered the top the chances of getting like a um, what was the best one unique. Yeah, the unique was the best one. So they likely lowered the rates of getting those while upping it to 100% chance for it to be grand. That seems like how they do everything. They always take if they give. And then I also got a haunted chest. Those are pretty worthless. Um, yeah. So there you go. Um, that was the prince purses. I'm going to go ahead and hit the uh, floor three. And... Um, We'll look at those. Well, I just got to the library, and uh, I was going to go ahead and do some uh, some additional uh, coin purses, but um, 
I, I just looked at the notes and the uh, the, uh, the the game servers are actually going to be coming down, so um, I won't be able to um, do the testing in this video, but uh, I'll post more videos. If you guys like what you saw, we learned about the uh, coin purses, the Prince coin purses, and the Prince crates. Um, I know there's supposed to be a new one that's like a super safe that's locked and you got to use masonry to craft a key to unlock that bad boy. I didn't get any of those, so um, uh, perhaps I'll find some from the uh, the library mobs or the uh, if I can get a group together, we could uh, go ahead and spawn some of those mobs that drop the queen's purses. Um, we'll see if we can get that done. There is another testing window coming up tonight, so I will continue making these videos. If you like what you saw, go ahead and hit the like or thumbs up button on YouTube. If you have questions or you want to see another aspect of the game, uh, my Twitter handle is in the description. Go ahead and tweet me. Let me know what you want to see. And uh, uh, if I get enough of you guys interested in a certain aspect, I'll go ahead and test it out and throw up a video. Thanks, guys. Take it easy.